This is Mark Henry, the world's strongest man. The figure is part of the WWE Elite Collection Series 5 by Mattel. Um, just a little bit of information about Mark Henry. He started out as an Olympic uh, weightlifter and he was the first to sign a 10 year contract with WWF. He started out as a good guy but then he entered the uh, nation of domination and later has an affair with Mae Young and together she gave birth to a hand and yeah it's, it's actually a hand and all the information was provided to me by my good friend here on YouTube uh, he is Jeff the future he and I just want to give a shout out to him uh, he has to be the biggest WWE fan I have ever seen uh, so anyway, if you have seen that video with Mae Young, it was a little bit funny and disgusting at the same time. I'm sure a lot of you have seen that video and it was like immediately the word that is going to come to your mind is what the F. <laughs> I mean, she was lying, well, she was lying on the bed and she smoked a cigar uh, just immediately right before she she uh, gave birth to a slimy hand i mean it was funny and um well back then mark henry well he didn't have uh he didn't have this look but uh i have a, an older figure by jack pacific that uh, probably portray him in his uh in his earlier years um so i have this guy i mean this is not a very good figure, but it might be close to how he looked uh, back then. Uh, he had his, his hair tied up. So, uh, well, but as you can see, the look is not very bad. This is by Jack Pacific. Uh, so you you really have to applaud, you know, uh, Mattel for 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 such a for such a well done job with the, with a really accurate look to Mark Henry so uh, for accessory he comes with this base and the name tag it says Mark Henry and uh, beside this he comes with a really huge barbell that the total weight is about 900 pounds I mean that is really something um, for me I am only 5 foot 3 and the, the maximum that I could live is 75 pounds on, on, on both sides which is a total of 150 pounds so 900 pounds is r really a lot uh, but I thought each individual well way I guess I, I, I thought each individual is removable but they are not uh, and they well well Mattel also included the stopper or some kind of lock to uh, to stop these uh, this ring from 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 sliding out so that's I mean they really try to be accurate here and uh, let's take a, take a look at the back you can see it said WSM on the back of his outfit very nice the head I have to say I, I have to say that's really accurate and the look of him I mean big and short well kind of short but he's still tall so uh, let me give you a look at the packaging and it is the same type of packaging for all Elite Collection figures so far uh, it says Serify his name and on the back at the top is a little bit of stats it's about uh, Mark Henry and the, uh, the other five figures of Serify we have Rey Mysterio I got him as well uh, we have Ziggler, we have uh, Koslov Rero and Jack Swagger. I really don't care for 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 for, for Chavo because I I really don't like that guy. And I didn't I didn't get Jack or Dog because I think their head scopes are a little bit off, and I really don't care for Koslov either. But uh, expect a, a review on Rey Mysterio. And on to the figure. Uh, let's remove this barbell. And I have to say the bar is really, it is made of a really weak plastic. I mean, it bends very easily. 
Uh, I just hope Mattel will include a metal, real metal uh, barbell because I'm sure eventually this thing is going to break. Uh, so let's put that aside. Uh, the figure, the, the well, the figure itself is very accurate, uh, very big, but uh, not so big compared to the Big Show. His, uh, well, his bicep is is a repaint or reissue of the Big Show, but the forearm is way bigger. And talking about the Big Show, let me uh, bring him out here just for comparison. So as you can see, the height or or the look is very accurate. Uh, Mark Henry is big but shorter than the Big Show, and his hand, as you can see, uh, I, I mean his hand and his legs are just huge. Uh, and um, I believe this thing, um, I mean it might be the same as this, but right now I'm gonna guess this is a singlet. Uh, I'm not sure I'm pronouncing that right, but uh, let me give you a closer look at the head sculpt. Uh, you might not be able to see it very well with my camera, but you can see it is a really good lightning. And for articulation, uh, his head has a ball joint, but it's kind of loose, as you can see, but can go all the way around and up and down. Uh, he has a ball jointed uh, shoulder, swivel at the bicep, single hinge uh, elbow. Uh, the wrist can rotate and move from side to side or up and down. Uh, the app can crunch, swivel at the waist. Uh, Marvel Universe ball jointed hip, swivel at the upper thigh. Underneath the uh, knee guard is a double hinge knee. Uh, so at the boots, hinge at the knee, and the foot can tilt. So very nice. Uh, let me put him on his base here. So so this is a really good figure, really accurate. I think I've, I've said that already. Um, but overall, I would recommend this figure. Uh, Target is now having a sale on Elite Collection figure for $10. So if you are still on the fence about Elite Collection figure, you know, go out to Target and get this figure now. Uh, so you can really see how how good they are and how well done, well, how well done they were made. Um, so anyway, $10 is a really good deal. So if you are a WWE fan or Mark Henry fan, you know, go out and get this figure. Uh, now is a really good time. I would highly recommend this guy to all WWE fans. If you are not a WWE fan, you know, um, well, just check out the figure so you can see uh, what a good job Mattel has done. So anyway, um, thank everybody, thanks everybody for watching and last shout out uh, to my friend Jeff the Future. Uh, go to his channel, subscribe to him, add him as a friend. So there you go. Thanks for watching.